WTFNN. Headline News Update. Hi folks, Basil Chapman here on this Thursday. Uh, this is June the 2nd. We're looking at the, look at this E-mini one-minute chart. Screens up to the uh, 4106-ish area. And then drops sharply down to the 40, 40.73, 74 area. And now look at the way it's just walking the nine period exponential moving average, stopping at the 200 period moving average for a rest. Let's see what happens if at any point today uh, it's able to get to 4112. That's uh, we're at 4098 and hold there for about 35 minutes. I think that could bring in a whole bunch of new buying or that could be where the selling starts. But that would be <clears throat> that would be really important. Uh, most importantly, we're looking at right now. Here we go. <clears throat> Excuse me. The Dow is down off the lows. It's down. It held the, the nine period moving average. It's at 32,705, down 107. Very important because if you put it together with the VIX index, if the VIX index later in the day keeps pulling back and gets towards the 24s, 2411 is the 200 period moving average. That's going to be really important. First time it's been there in weeks, uh, in, in, in actually over a month. What we're looking at is the S&P at this particular stage is down. Oh, it's now up. Up to at 41.03, nice action. You want to see 42.05, somewhere early by next week, Monday or Tuesday. You're looking at the QQQs. Now, they had been leading all morning, and they're leading again. They're up $1.70 at 307.70, but they need to get to uh, they need to get to the 30, sorry, the 312 to 315 area. And in, in a couple of days, so that's really important. IWM coming back nicely is now up to at 186. Looking at gold, uh, gold had a nice rally earlier on. Oh, look at that! It's now just above the 200 period moving average, up 20 at 18.69. If gold can start, oh, I, I got a question about silver. I'll do that right now. If they're still listening, uh, silver at 22.24, acting a little bit better than it had. But until it's really trading the 22.65 to 23.10 area and holding there on a closing basis, if it does that, that's going to be really important. Could finally see a better move up. Looking at crude oil, it was down sharply. Now it's come back. It's up 32 cents at 115.57. Uh, this is amazing action for crude oil. What can I say? The TLT, that's amazing action. The downside is down 40 ticks at 116.08. So yields keep uh, rallying. Have a wonderful rest of the day. Stay tuned for Larry Pussyventure, Think or Swim, uh, Steve Rhodes, Dave White, and Tom O'Brien wraps it up today. Check out my opening call daily newsletter, and I hope you have a wonderful day. See you tomorrow. The reality 